So it's Sunday morning. It's time for the vlog. address those so it's Saturday I'm headed down to my nephew's birthday which we'll probably have a little footage of but I'm stopping and while I'm stopped I wanted to bring up the point that um, the two th items that I can't talk about have been resolved um, I can talk about one of them on this vlog but the other I've been asked not to uh, talk about until December 27th. So on December 27th, I will discuss that, the second item. So, what is this first item? All right, so the thing I can talk about. Uh, recently, what happened is the hospital I work in um, bid out our jobs. They wanted to see if they could get it, uh, medical equipment repaired cheaper. Um, since we're a not-for-profit, we pass exactly our cost through, and we're, the company I work for actually owns half of the hospital, it would be very hard to beat our price. That is, with an apples-to-apples -apples bid. And they, they were unable. We were kept. And we, I just couldn't announce that we were keeping the job um, at the hospital I work at until I knew that we were keeping it. They also didn't want to make public the fact that it was even out for bid, uh, just in case anything can go sideways in, in um, social media. Social media has caused so many problems with people just mentioning things innocently that they asked us not to uh, not to talk about it outside of the immediate circles. So we didn't. So that was a big win. Uh, all the jobs, more so because there were, are several people who report to me who were very stressed out about the job. Obviously I was too. But we had to go put together the, the proposal so that um, those guys could keep their jobs and and my upper management did a great job. Um, I was happy to be part of that, but you know, we have a lot of guys looking at us um, who you know are feeding families, and we're worried that another company might come in. So it's a big win. I'm happy about it. Merry Christmas. <laughs> now, there's another thing that has been going on that I have hesitated to address. There's been great talk about slicing cheese within our community. And it breaks my heart to see that Capitan Bastos, my brother, is teaching my niece Amina to use outdated Norwegian technology. I mean, who uses a carpenter's tool on cheese? It's, it's pretty, it's heartbreaking. And <clears throat> who wants only sliced cheese? I mean, what if you want a block of cheese? There's no way an Otterhavel, Osterhavel, or as I like to call it, oyster shovel, um, can make a nice square bit of cheese for your truly sophisticated guests and company. I mean, everyone knows that people of sophistication like variants in the way that their cheese is served. So truly sophisticated individuals <coughs> use a cheese slicer. Yes, a cheese slicer. You can make perfectly sliced cheese. Let's say you have some smoked gouda. For a nice round piece to make, to put on wiener toast. Instead of some little strip where you have to put 27 of them across a piece of bread because they're small and <laughs> ineffectual. No one wants small and ineffectual cheese. Or, if you want to serve blocks of cheese, or diced cheese, or bricks of cheese, depending on what you call them. Also, cheese slicer.
ban. So I'm hoping that my brother Einstein, Capitan Bastos, will move into the current level of technology and use a cheese slicer. But, as I understand, they may not have cheese slicers in Norway. They're so proud of their outdated technology. I am sending him a cheese slicer. And we will see if he learns to cut the cheese properly. Alright, so I hope everybody's getting ready for Christmas. And those who maybe celebrate Hanukkah, I hope you had a happy Hanukkah. Um, Festival of Lights. And those who celebrate anything else, I hope your holidays are as exciting as well. This Christmas is going to be a little different. Um, but it'll still be with family. And, uh, and I'm sure it'll still be great. So this week, the big announcement was that we get to keep our jobs. <laughs> and uh, the next big announcement I will uh, actually be able to talk about after the 27th. So it'll be the vlog after Christmas. And Christmas is a week from Monday. So I will have one more vlog where I can't talk about the other thing. And then I'll have no more secrets. Well, well no more that you know about. <laughs> so anyway, remember that I love you. Take care of yourself. And rock on.